Well, traffic congestion has been a bane for Lagos residents and in a bid to ease vehicular movement across the state, the state government has identified 60 gridlock junctions to be configured. State Commissioner for Transportation, Frederick Oladengde, inspected key roundabouts across the metropolis due for collapse ahead of the configuration for ease of traffic. Correspondent Kunke Adesoji reports. As part of the junction improvement works and traffic system management, seven pilot schemes will be unlocked, 27 locations identified, and four roundabouts across key axes in the metropolis will be removed for ease of traffic. The identified locations are Ikotun, Second Roundabout on Lekki Epe Expressway, Olen Avenue, Roundabout, and Maryland. <laughs> to achieve this feat, Lagos residents will be subjected to four months of traffic gridlock, the time needed to complete and deliver this infrastructure, as well as slight demolition to create alternative routes. The idea of having a signalized and synchronized um, uh, traffic system is to ensure that everybody moves progressively at the same time. When you stop, you won't stop for more than two minutes. You make progress again, you don't stop for more than two minutes. But it is better than stopping for 20 minutes. The complete remodeling of uh, many of the roundabouts that we feel have outlived their usefulness. In uh, On Allen Avenue, uh, uh, Maryland, all of this modeling will be done. And the belief is that after all that, the traffic will flow better. Taking to cognizance the challenges of traffic management across the metropolis, GM of the Lagos State Traffic Management Authority, LASMA, employed motorists in construction locations to observe safety precautions and cooperate with the traffic management officers for free flow of traffic. Hurrying unnecessarily doesn't lead to anything positive. Please, when you get to this roundabout, where the construction is going on, give way to traffic already on the roundabout. Meanwhile, road users on the corridors of the Lekki Koyi Link Bridge and the Lekki Ekpe Expressway were advised to get their e tag before January 1st, 2020, as cash payment will no longer be accepted at the toll plazas. The planned migration to electronic payment is to reduce the travel time and road congestion on both corridors. As the traffic management adjustment kicks off across designated locations across the metropolis simultaneously, resident hopes that traffic managers will be all out to ensure that congestions are reduced. Funke Adesoji, STV News.